Oh my God, you can't make this thing up. I just noticed this article from the Telegraph and they're telling us not one, not two, but hundreds of churches across Scotland is up for sale. Unbelievable. Unbelievable. Now, some of these churches, if not all of them, are built on ley lines. They are built on sacred grounds. Now, when you take the spirituality of a country and you sell it, you give it away for silver and gold, what do you expect in return for your culture, your country, and your power? What do you expect is going to happen? Do you think you're going to maintain your wealth and your power when you do this thing? Britain is supposed to be a Christian country with Christian morals and principle. And the article clearly states that the UK is turning away from its Christian morals. Now, if you are turning away from your Christian God, what are you turning into? Can that God that you are turning to, can that God give you the wealth and power and let you keep it? Can that God that you are turning to let you keep it? Now, Britain, Scotland, let's not get in our feelings when others purchase your sacred grounds. When other people from other religions purchase your sacred grounds and they start to pray on these ley lines. Let's not get in our feelings because you gave it away for silver and gold. You turn your back on your God, right? Britain is supposed to be a Christian country and you all, you are all just full of yourself. You are full of yourself. You walk over the tails in your back and you hold on to various agendas that the people that you think are your best interests give to you, especially the LGBTQ agenda. The LGBTQ God cannot help you, right? But you are turning your back on your very own God. You are not even selling one or two, but hundreds of your church, your sacred grounds. You are selling it for silver and gold. My God, you can't make this thing up. And if you think you're going to be more powerful, more wealthy for destroying the heart of your power, you have another thing coming. You won't be more powerful for what you have done or what you are doing. That is your sacred grounds. That is where you go and you pray. But you forget. You forget because you're too rich. You have too much. It is a sad day. But I'm just sitting back and I'm watching as the UK self-destruct. Because a nation that is not standing with their God a nation that is not standing with the Most High is a nation that is easy to be defeated and their people be rounded up and put in slavery. Right? You never see it coming, but we try to warn you. Unbelievable. Go check the article out for yourself. Use critical thinking. Connect the dots because I do not want to hear anybody crying or demonstrating when those churches are taken over by other religions, right? We need to pray and say glory be to the most high.